What's going on, everyone? This is your favorite collector, Sweet Wills, and welcome back to some Lounge Fly news. And I know I have my thumbnail talking about SDCC, but yeah, we're going to get into it. But first, let me give y'all some other news. Up uh, first, I want to talk about the Golden Grails. Now, you know, since it started, I've been giving y'all this information so we can keep up to date what's going on in the UK. Like I mentioned before, no information of none of this coming to the U.S. or the A. But once I get anything, if it does, I'm going to let you know. They went ahead and did the fifth hint. If you look on the left, you see it has a bow. On the right is the actual bag. So it's this mini mouse crossbody bag. Now this bag here will be available on FunkoEurope.com and the other selected retailers on Tuesday, July 11th at 9 a.m. BST time. I'm really excited that we're down to the last bag when it comes to the Golden Grails. Now, we don't have any hints yet, but comment down below and tell me what you think. If you had to guesstimate on what the last bag is or what you hope it could be or what you think it might be. Also, 707 Street got this brand new exclusive to them. This bag here is currently available on their website. It was released, what, a week? Uh, maybe less than a week ago something like that since i haven't gotten around to doing a video since the release here you all have it i was about to start saying how bad eh, 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 can i be i'm just be yeah that's that lorax but i'm tripping all right so <laughs> amazon.com got this brand new exclusive you see we have gary we know this is sponge by people right here not only just a bag but it come with the wallet as well this is really nice if i didn't get sandy i probably would have got gary i don't know no i stick to sandy i mean they're gonna collab with everything but i ain't mad at y'all over there at hello kitty land i ain't mad at you you see we got the hello kitty cowgirl. girl i mean what's next the bull rider i don't know <laughs> I'm just saying Hello Kitty is collaborating with everything. When I say everything, I mean everything. I mean, what's next? But this bag here is really cute. And y'all can find it on Amazon.com on the retro facts. Sorry if y'all hear the rain in the background. I don't know where this rain. Look, let me tell you something. Hot as it is in Texas, we need all the rain, the wind, the snow, the breeze we can get. Because y'all, it be cooking out here. Back to the videos. So we have your WDWstore.net has this brand new Mickey fireworks bag and it's beautiful on their website. So please go ahead and check it out. And yeah, this is a really nice bag. If not, since the fort has already passed, if y'all missed it, you can definitely, I mean, you can wear it any other time of the year. But you know, for those who like to wear certain bags for holidays, this will be a perfect bag for the next 4th of July, Memorial Day. You can even, if you want to, wear it on Veterans Day. I mean, everybody, you know, everybody has their own thing and their own taste when it comes to putting these bags together for holidays. I mean, it's up to you. Now we're going to talk about, before we get into the SDCC releases, let's talk about these Shop Disney Lounge Flies, shall we? Up uh, first, they showed us a picture of the brand new Halloween bag. I know a lot of y'all been wanting the candy corn bag to come back. Look, you know how this is. Look, y'all, I understand y'all want that bag back, but some things we just got to leave alone, okay? We just got to leave stuff alone. Okay, I have it, and I don't want it coming back because y'all going to bring the value down of my bag, and I ain't got time for that. <laughs> But if they do bring it back, of course, just like any other bag, we ain't got no control over that. And I'm going to definitely let you all know. But we have this brand new bag. This bag here is really cute. I'm not going to get this bag. I probably would have gotten it if it was see-through. At first when I saw it, especially on the back, I thought it was see-through for a second. But yeah, um, really nice bag, but just not for sweet wheels. Y'all comment down below and tell me what you all think. And also, comment down below and let me know if you do want the candy corn bag to come back. Here are two more beautiful bags that's on Shop Disney. Looking to the left, we got the Disney 100 bag. And you see we have so many different Disney characters on there. I'm surprised that the hardest working mice is in the business didn't make the cut on this bag. But you know what? My clients could use a break right about now. But the bag is really, really nice. This here is a placement bag in an all-over print bag. So whatever you order on Shop Disney is whatever you get. If you have the opportunity to see it in person and get it, even better but it's a really really nice bag but i'm gonna stay away from there the one next to it, the animal print bag y'all i am so so want to get this bag so much because that baby is beautiful but sweet will's gonna have to hold off on it because i got a whole lot of stuff going on very soon I'm glad I'm finally learning. I'm not going to say learning because sometimes I don't be paying attention. You know how sometimes when you on Shop Disney, they, sh they have the same item showing twice. And I thought this was for a second until I read it. And then I realized this is not 
the same item that is actually different. So the one to the left is actually the Cinderella castle and the one to the right is the Sleeping Beauty castle. I'm really happy that they did it like this because not everybody wants to have a castle bag of Cinderella or even Sleeping Beauty. Some of them like Sleeping Beauty better, some of them like Cinderella. So if I had to get one, y'all already know which one I'm getting. I just want to let everyone know when placing the order, no, you're not seeing double. It's actually two different castles on the bag. Shout out to Lounge Flying Disney for doing something like this. Listen, this is what I'm talking about right here. This, whew. There are some other new bags or a new bag that's on Shop Disney that I didn't pit, put in the video. So you can definitely go on Shop Disney, type in Loungefly to check that out. But these will be the last three bags I'm talking about. Now, the first one is from WandaVision. This bag has restocked on the website. So if you all missed out on it, definitely go over to Shop Disney and get it. In the middle, they have this brand new New York bag, which is really nice, but not something for Sweet Wheels. And the last bag is the Dark Vader one. And I believe this one actually glows in the dark. That'll be all for my Shop Disney Lounge Fly news. Now let's go over to SDCC, which is San Diego Comic Con for 2023 Lounge Fly. Now they are releasing some Funko items. I'm not going to talk about that in this video. Maybe I'll do a video before the SDCC releases and then I'll put them in there. But as far as the bags are concerned, when it comes to Lounge Fly, these items will be on loungefly.com. There, there's one that will be on funko.com. And these releases will happen on July 20 at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time on both websites. Up first, I'm going to talk about these two brand new Star Wars bags along with the wallets. Now, these two bags here are currently available for pre-order on Amazon.com. Comment down below and tell me what you all think. I'm not a big fan of neither one of these bags. They're nice bags, but they just don't, you know, scream, sweet wheels, come and get me. Take me home with you. I'm not getting it from it. I'm just not going to be able to do it, Star Wars. Also, Entertainment Earth has this particular bag available for pre-order. This bag seems to be an all-over print bag. I'm not sure if the placement is going to be different. You all notice that some of these all-over print bags, the placements, some of the placements that I have seen lately are still all the same on each bag. I don't know what's going on. What y'all think about that? Would you prefer... If it's an all over print that each bag has the same print or would you like each bag print to be different? Put that down below in the comment section. I don't follow the dinosaurs as much, but I noticed that there's a lot of Jurassic Park fans out there and a lot of collectors are definitely interested in this bag. You all see how the bag looks to the left. I love the neon colors, but when you look to the right, this joker actually glows in the dark and a lot of collectors are super excited about this bag. I myself just found out about this wallet and oh yeah, this thing is nice. Oh yes, indeed it is nice. I like that plate. Oof. One of my favorite, no, hold on, let me slow down. That's one of a few of the favorite plates that I like to see. I'm going to have to calm it down. Wait a minute, because I do got a favorite plate, do I? I probably, I need to think about it. Give me some time, y'all. Give me some time. At first, I was wondering, why is this bag $125? Maybe you all that's into fashion and you know about different materials, you can let your girl Sweet Wheels know. But this backpack right here, this Transformer Soundwave, which is a Decepticon, keep that in mind, is retailing at $125. Now, the only information that I've seen about this bag is that it's premium vegan leather and has a lot of details to it. Now, I don't know due to the premium leather, is that that's the reason why it costs $125? I have no clue. Y'all comment down below and let me know. I don't know nothing about materials, textures, or none of that stuff. But I have a feeling that Sweet Wheels might be going for this bag. Just like the third bag on my list. We're going to get into the bags that I'm really going to go for. I, but I really like this one a lot. Look at that cassette. Oh, my goodness. And next to that, we got this pin set that we'll be releasing. And the retail of this pin set is $20. I'm trying to figure out the size of this joker. Y'all remember the Ghostbuster bag? I want to know. I don't think it's. No, it's just probably like a longer, long fly. I don't know. I'm kind of confused. I need to see some live photos of this baby right here. Next to that, we got from the book of Bubba Fag. Y'all remember that show, right? Remember that Wookiee, the bounty hunter? So this is him. I mean, they executed this bag. A hundred percent executed this bag. And I seen the show. I think I seen the first three or four episodes. But I remember him for sure. I remember him. And look at that scar on the owl. Yeah, they did that. And that wallet. Come on now. Y'all better stop it, Lounge Fly. Y'all better stop it. Now look a here. Look a here. 
Look a here, look a here, look a here. Lounge Fly really want all of the money. They come to take all that overtime money. Y'all better have y'all bills paid. Now, Lounge Fly, this is what I'm talking about. This is what you need to start doing. This is a bag and a pop bundle right here. All right, take notes from this. Listen to me, Lounge Fly. Take notes from this. This here is what you call a bag and a pop bundle. All right, I don't have this pop. I don't know if this pop ever came out. Maybe it did. I don't know. I don't have it in my collection. But look at that bag. Look how nicely the caterpillar butterfly just sit up in that thing like that. And it's cookies. Y'all know how I love sweets. Oh, my goodness. At this point, y'all have set the mark. Y'all need to go up from here. Y'all need to go up. Don't be giving us just anything, just throwing stuff out there. Oh, they like this. Oh, we got about... 200 we got about 4,000 mandalorians let's throw some glitter on him nah nah don't do none of that give us a new mold make a bag that looks awesome like this and i mean we there now the thing about this particular bag here is this bag and pop bundle will show up on loungefly.com and due to the fact that it's a funko it will be on funko.com on july 20 at 9 a.m pacific standard time the price of this bag here is $120, and it's a limited edition of $4,000. This joker here is on me list. If I don't get this bag, somebody, lounge flag, y'all put one to the side just in case I don't get it. Email me at sweetwells19 at gmail.com so y'all can send me one and stop playing. Now, I know a lot of y'all just missed that 100 Disney stitch that was a loungefly.com exclusive that sold out under a minute, probably less than that. Some people said 20 seconds. I was trying to go for it, but if I, if I got it, it would have been cool if, by me missing it. It didn't really bother me. But my signal sucked where I was at. I picked the right time to go somewhere that didn't have signal. Boy, don't you just dislike that. But we got this brand new stitch with scrump bag and i like the material on this particular bag not your regular backpack material i like that also it comes with a wallet it seems to be a pin down there i don't have any information on the pin at all but the bag is the main thing i'm concerned about because i got to have it i'm going for that bag next to that we have rocket and group and it's a really nice bag but let's go back to stitch sorry rock i'm sorry I had to do it to you but we got to go back to stitch that's an amazing looking bag long fly y'all been doing y'all thing but keep in mind what i said about them pop and bag bundles look you got the blueprint right now look at that and then go from there don't be giving us anything. I'm just throwing it out there. I'm giving my two cents that usually cost 35% that I still haven't got yet. Y'all listen, I'm going to have to start sending some IOUs they way. More like they owe me they way. <laughs> Let me stop playing. All right, everyone. So that'll do it for my video today. I hope y'all enjoyed it. And like always, if you're watching this video and you had not subscribed to my channel, definitely go ahead and subscribe, like, share, and comment on this video. Also hit that notification bell. Make sure you click on all so you can be notified whenever I drop a video or a community post. And until next time, sweet willers and other collectors out there, take care.